Hey everyone, James Reeves, TFB TV, day one of Enforce Tech here in Nuremberg. I'm at the RX booth. RX, perhaps one of the most underrated manufacturers in the business. Slovenian company, I've toured the factory before. You guys have seen that maybe five years ago. One of my favorite companies. I'm with the CEO, Tim. Thank you so much, Tim, Thanks, for being on the program. We have a very unusual looking version of the RX here, yeah. uh, a very purpose built pistol. Go ahead and tell me what you can tell me about this. This pistol that we have here is one of the many versions that we have of the Deltas. This is developed specifically for a NATO tender, for a large NATO country, which I cannot tell the customer now because we are in the final phase. But he had a lot of, there was a lot of requests about uh, durability, several weather conditions, uh, size of the magazine, capacity, all kind of these shapes. And you see that they come in four or five different shapes, from a, from a, a middle size to like a full length, even with a compressor. That's what we can do. We are very flexible. We have a super flexible production. Um, we have a very able engineers, and we customize the solutions. This is the best example. I think uh, we're doing quite well with this right now. So tell me briefly, let's say I'm a viewer and I don't know what the Rex Delta is. Tell me briefly about it. The Deltas is the, the duty line, the mm -hmm. duty line of pistols with all optics ready, different lengths and sizes. Um, so this is our portfolio, basically. How are these going to be configured? How is this different than like a standard Delta that I can go get at my gun store? Okay, so this is the Delta in a special version, the RX Delta long slide with an even longer barrel and a muzzle brake on it, so which is the request of the customer. A three-stage compressor which you can select, so depending on what ammunition you use, you can adjust the compressor to this, uh, to this specific ammunition. Any Delta comes totally ambidextrous, so this mag release works on both sides. Also, the slide catch is MB, and of course, uh, the, the disassembly level. We have a loaded chamber indicator with every gun. This is here, which will show up uh, like, like uh, it's feelable and visible uh, if, you, if there is a, a chamber in the, uh, around the chamber. In this case, you see the front and rear sides are higher than you would normally have it because it's designed to also hold a silencer, which means you have a, a, a line of sight above the silencer when it's attached. In this version, a red dot is, uh, is, is added. All these guns come optic ready. They come with five different plates, so it would, they would fit to any available optics in the market. This one is made on special request from the, from the new customer, but uh, it's interchangeable with anything. This one, though, is developed exactly for this customer because, because they specified which site they will use. Mm -hmm. It has a special uh, special serration because it will also be used by marine soldiers, which have to use gloves and, and they are and, and it's in the wet, so it's extremely grippy. It also has, for that reason, this porting, so that the water can get out qu faster and uh, the, the barrel can cool down quicker. The magazine is also custom made. It's 24 rounds. Um, in this case, also there is a low cap, which is still 22 rounds, so these two versions were, were demanded. And what is also new for a military customer is that they wanted a jet funnel for quick magazine change. Um, so this is, I would say, after 23 years in the industry, this is the closest hybrid I see between a sport gun and a duty gun. This customer selected, selected uh, the, exactly this mix of colors. The serrations are different. It was demanded to be very, very extremely grippy with gloves and or bloody fingers. You know what, what you want to have. And it's a, of course, a, a NATO country. We can say that this is like a NATO contract gun that has yes. met very stringent standards. Ab absolutely. This is all, like it's not only NATO. It's like where I come from. So it's. It get, doesn't get more complicated. It's a book like that, you know, a book like that that right, you have to fulfill. Right, right. And uh, it runs through all the tests and every NATO standard test will be repeated or has already been repeated on this one. So there's a lot of small detailed features about trigger weight, about everything that all uh, respond to the NATO needs. But also there are a lot of customized requests, like, for example, a jet funnel, which you normally don't see on duty guns. Right. But here, this is because it's for special forces. They've seen it. They want the jet funnel. They want this. They want the possibility to put a silencer on in, in front. So, so it's a big package. I think the whole package is 
like it's a big box per gun, which is the silencers, the red red dots. It's, it's all together. So it's for us a quite interesting project, and it looks like we're doing well with it. What is this going to be called? March. Uh, what is it? You mean by the name? Yes. Yeah. Uh, what is this pistol going to be called? I can't tell you because the name would tell who the owner is. <laughs> I see. I see. Okay. But it's gonna still be gonna be an RX, RX, okay. and then yeah, right. Got it. <laughs> and uh, finally, is this ever going to be released to the civilian market? Well, let me put it that way: if we win the tender, we will definitely do it because hey, we have best promotion. Right. If we don't win the tender, we spend a lot of efforts into making this anyway. So yes, it will be available <laughs> this way or the other. <laughs> Now, I have to ask: I know that something like this, it's under contract. I know you're not. You're, It's fine if you don't want to tell me, but is there any potential that you could give me, like an MSRP ballpark, if this did get released to the civilian market? Because they're going to ask. Uh, you don't have to tell me, but no, actually, uh, I, 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 but I have to I, ask. You have to, and I seriously don't know yet. Yeah. Because right, the calculation for this one is now based on the on the package that we provide, right. which is like a huge mix of everything, and that's usually confidential information, yeah, anyways. Usually, we will always be. Compared to anybody else of the market, we will be slightly below that price level because we are luckily working in a country that has lower work costs, so we can provide good prices. So it's, it's not going to be a shock to anybody. Right, right. Well, Tim, thank you so much for speaking to us on camera. I know that this is kind of a sensitive subject, but we are here at Enforce Tech, which is you military law enforcement. So yeah, yeah, yeah. So th thank you very much, and guys, thank you for watching. Stay tuned. We're bringing you more from Enforce Tech and Iwa.